everyone. These are the directions for our computer lab drawing. Uh, it's going to be essential for this drawing that you have your computer table correctly drawn because you're actually going to put that into this drawing. And all I'm doing in this is giving you a starting point because of some mistakes I've found people have made in the past. And you're going to be doing all of your own measurements in it except for the ones that you can see here. These are the measurements of the entire room and this is what you're going to want to start your drawing out as. So you can see I have this main rectangle right here that's 29 feet 6 inches by 38 feet 4 inches and I've added this rectangle here that's 20 feet by 7 foot 10 inches and I've just made those doing two rectangles. The first thing I'm going to want to do when I'm done with that is come over here and erase this little line so that we don't have that in there. Now the second thing I want to do is I don't want a paper thin floor or paper thin walls and so we're just going to come and push pull the floor up a little bit and really you can do it you know let's just go four inches and that will be the push pull of that. The second one is we want wall thickness and a lot of students ran into problems with wall thickness last time when we did this last trimester so that's why I'm doing this presentation. At any rate what we want to do for wall thickness is we want to come in and set it right now because a lot of times students would lead to lead, um, wait excuse me, until later in their drawing and they would have problems. So we're going to go around here and hit your, your shift key and we're going to select every one of the sides of our computer lab. Having a hard time getting this. There we go, finally. And there I have all of the sides of it selected. So now I'm going to come get my offset and I'm going to pull this edge out right here. And I'm just going to pull it out a five inches. And I'll hit that. And now you're set to be successful uh, setting up your computer lab. So now what we can do is we can zoom in and here's a measurement you'll have to make on your own. And, um, and go ahead and just push pull the whole wall up to whatever height of the wall is. Um, a couple things on this lab that, you, that you're going to be doing, one of them is you're going to have to import your desk that you made from your previous drawing and you're going to, make a, and you're going to be making copies of it as you make this computer lab. Now, in terms of the stuff you need, you need all the built-in cabinetry that is in the computer lab. For instance, we know right as we walk in, there's a lot of cabinets right along this wall right here. We know we've got the island right here that's got the printer on it with the 3D printer. And we know we've got the little thing comes out here that's got the TV on it. Those all need to be included. You need to have the whiteboard up here and the like. What you don't need to do is you don't need to include any desks that aren't the desk that the computers are on that look like the one you drew in your last activity. And we've got a number of those in the room. And if you have any questions on it, just ask me and I'll let you know what you need to include. But everything needs to be its correct size and everything needs to be put in the correct place of, in, in terms of the room in how it's laid out. And then the final thing you'll want to do is you're going to want to make some things with the scene tool in here, which will basically walk us into your computer lab and around your computer lab. And I'll explain how that's done when you get to that point. It's a very, very simple tool. At any rate, I wanted to do this part of it for you because this is a part that people have had trouble with in the past. You need to get all of these measurements just as you see them. And you need to make sure you do your offset and get your wall thickness before you start putting any doors in here or anything like that. Okay? So, uh, oh, and you can also, you also want to put all the computers in here and chairs, but you are allowed to bring the computers and chairs in from the, uh, the library. You do not have to draw those. And that's it. Have a good time doing your computer lab.